WWE stockholders will own 49% of the company. So essentially, if you have, you know, a certain number of points in WWE, and using Vince McMahon as the example, Vince has 38% of WWE. He will now have 19% of the new company. And he'll actually be the biggest shareholder in the new company, and he's executive chairman, and he's back in charge, and he was running TV tonight. So any of that talk that, that uh, you know, he's, he's, it's, it's, he's back. It's, it's what it was. It will be what it was before. And, you know, that's if people think that that was bad, it will be bad. You know, if that's, you know, and uh, that's just the door. That's just the way it is. And, you know, the TV show was changed when Vince got there and it was changing as the show was going on. And that was that was tonight. Um, and that will be, you know, that will be what it is going forward. And, uh, you know, Area Manual is not going to be involved in the wrestling. Vince is Vince is running the company. Um, Nick Khan will be number two, and Paul Levesque will be head of creative. Um, so he's going to be doing the busy work and all that stuff. But he's not going to be. Um, I mean, Vince is going to have final say on everything. It, you know, when it comes to that, and even with Area Manual being number one, um, Harry said, you know, in the interview that was released on CNBC today, that if there's disagreement. And Vince doesn't want something on the wrestling side; it's not going to get done. So, um, and they were—they said they really wanted Vince, and there you go. Um, that's that's the big picture stuff. You got any other questions? Well, we'll go through all of these. We talked about a lot of this and uh, what it potentially could mean on the show yesterday. If you did not hear the Sunday edition of the show, make sure to listen to that because we spent about a half hour on this, but. Anthony here says, in the case of Kenny Omega or others whose AEW contracts are up before the merger is approved and finalized, could they be scared off from signing with WWE? Did uncertainty over what the product will be like once it is a part of Endeavor? Well, what it is now is what it's going to be. Like, yeah. it's it's already, I mean, you could watch this Raw show tonight, and man, this was, this was the old days. I mean, promising a main event, which they didn't deliver. An hour, a full hour, a commercial free hour, by the way, with two minutes of wrestling in it to open up the show. And it was just, it was the old, it was the old Raw again. So it's going to do a phenomenal rating, but which has nothing to do with the show. But, but um, I am pretty sure that, uh, you know, number one coming after WrestleMania is going to do a big number with all the news of the sale and the curiosities that's going to help the number. And, you know, announcing Roman Reigns and Brock Lesnar and Cody Rhodes all in this main event match. Um, if anything's going to keep the viewers till the end, that's it. Because, I mean, Brock never wrestles on TV. And he still didn't wrestle on TV. Roman rarely wrestles on TV and also didn't. And, uh, you know, they shot a big angle with uh, Cody and, and uh, Brock. But, I mean, as far as, look, everything's a factor. Everything's a factor. You know, like we say, like, will this make a difference? It is something else to think about. I mean, as far as, you know, with Kenny Omega and people like that, um, you know, it's, it's it, when, when it comes time for that decision, unless he's making the decision to stay, you know, he's going to make the decision to leave, that final decision coming for months anyway. So, you know, yeah, it, of course it has. it's going to have an effect. By the end of this, I was convinced Iron Mike Sharp is the best wrestler who ever lived. He's low-key at first. Like, ah, bah, bah, bah. But he keeps going. He claps. Bah, 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 bah. Yeah, I got a headlock. Yeah. <laughs> Ah, I'm tall. I'm giant Mike Sharp. If you enjoy these videos for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full length editions of the Brian and Vinny show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, the Mad Men podcast, Speak Now Pro Wrestling with Denise Salcedo and more, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.